Hello friends, welcome to the penultimate episode of the Archaeological Site Advent. Oh my goodness, we are getting so close to the end and what a ride it has been, honestly. I know I sang a song yesterday to celebrate 22, but the only song that I can think of for 23 is the Blink-182 song where they say, nobody likes you when you're 23, which not only ages me, but it's also like sad and untrue because I really think you're gonna like this site. So with that, let's go to the Valley of the Temples in Italy to help you like the number 23 again. The Valley of the Temples is located in Agrigento on the island of Sicily and is home to some of the most outstanding examples of Magna Graecia art and architecture, meaning they're some of the best preserved Greek ruins in the world outside of Greece. The majority of the monuments at the Valley of the Temples were first constructed in the 5th century BCE and includes the remains of seven temples in the Doric style of architecture, as well as an Olympion field, catacombs, and a necropolis. The funny thing about the Valley of the Temples is that it's not in the valley, it's actually on a ridge. But hey, the Valley of the Temples sounds pretty cool and very exciting, so... I understand. The site was destroyed by the Carthaginians in the year 406 BCE, and then again by the Christians in the 6th century AD, so most of what you're seeing are the heavily reconstructed efforts of a huge reconstruction conservation project that happened back in the 1800s. The best preserved temple is the Temple of Concordia, which was saved from destruction because it was turned into an early Christian church. And if you follow any archeology span accounts on Instagram, hopefully you're following me, you will have seen this famous image of a statue of a fallen Icarus in front of this temple. This is a piece of art donated by Polish sculptor Igor Mitaraj, and it is absolutely stunning, and I cannot wait to go and visit it and take all of the selfies in front of it because it's just such a cool juxtaposition between, you know, modern and ancient, and yet, you know, it's kind of paying homage to the ancient site, and it's, ah, I love it, it's beautiful, I want to go see it in person. That is it for day 23 of the Archaeological Site Advent. If you liked that video, go ahead and smash that like button down below. Don't forget to subscribe because there's only one more! There's only one more and it's coming out tomorrow. Are you excited? I'm excited. You do not want to miss it, trust me. Big thank you to all of my patrons over on Patreon. If you like the YouTube channel, you wanna help support the channel, head on over to Patreon and become a patron. Here are all of my socials and as always, stay dirty my friends.